Hey guys, in this video, we're going to talk about SOS. Now we're currently trading at 272 here on the daily chart. And I have no idea why I always talk about the stock. I'm like addicted to it for some reason. But anyway, we're up against this nine day EMA here on the daily. So going forward, that's going to be our first support slash resistance, depending on if we are gapping up or down on Monday. Now our next resistance is going to be this 277 area right here. And then above that, it will be 296. And that's currently right where that 50 day moving average is trading. Now we did break out of this falling channel. Um, we can probably delete these lines, but we're going to leave them here just in case we do end up going back in and respecting those trend lines. Um, but really, the, the big support is not coming here at this upper trend line. It's coming right here at this 243 mark. So support wise, obviously the low of the day that came in on Friday, that 256 first support below that it will be this 243 area here, which was support for us in the past. Uh, if we dig in deeper here on the 30 minute chart, you can see more or less um, big green, uh, I wouldn't say big green day, but green day in here um, moved pretty far away from that nine day EMA and then ultimately ended up right below it. Um, and, uh, and, and after hours kind of work our way back up above that. So, um, that is interesting to see here a little, um, everybody kind of pushed it up and then immediately just kind of sold it off. And then in after hours, everybody tried to get back into it. So that's, uh, something to keep an eye on in here on the daily chart, RSI 51, stochastics 15. So that's interesting that your RSI is neutral, but your stochastics in here are severely oversold. So keep an eye on this as well. See if these, um, two strength indexes here kind of start to diverge away even more than what they are, or they start kind of com coming closer together. Because usually you see oversold, oversold, or you see overbought, overbought. Um, it's kind of interesting to see you basically uh, kind of neutral here while your stochastics are saying, hey, you're really oversold in here. So that is interesting. You also have a cross here um, on, on your D and your K. Um, also, let's see, IV ranking here is nine. You have right around a 25 cent expected move by this Friday. Next Friday, right around a 35 cent expected move. And if you go all the way out to your August monthlies, right around 50 cents, everybody is pricing in. So IV in here is relatively low to itself. And it looks like everything is fairly cheap because of that. So you do have a lot of volume. Obviously, everything's on the call side in here, right around 5,000 of those $3 calls traded on um, Friday. And they're trading for right around eight or nine cents a piece so you're not getting ripped off at all in here if you are trying to buy any sort of call or buy any sort of put because there's really no iv there's no juice in here um whatsoever so iv rank is really really low um again just keep an eye on this rsi stochastics um watch this nine day ema on the daily that's going to give you a heads up as to um our first support slash resistance depending on if we're gapping up or down watch the 277s and then watch that 296 level ultimately up here with that 50 day moving average on the daily here um right in that area as well okay guys thanks for watching make sure to check us out on our social media we have attached the links to our socials in the description and we also have a trading service if you're interested there's more information in the description below